When we choose to leave a place of comfort and convenience for the unknown, we are then in a place of uncertainty. Without routine, we are in a constantly changing environment, and in knowing this lies the true value of planning. Understanding what humans need at a base level is a good start. In this episode, I plan for a trip with these simple base level needs as a priority. The rest is just fun. And here goes the rooftop camper folded out. It took quite a bit of work to get it to this point. So I decided to test it out on the car. It also took a little bit of fudging to get everything to work, but I ended up taking it for a drive after I put some ratchet straps and it worked well. The whole unit is under 100 pounds, so it didn't seem to bother the acceleration or top speed of the car. This one has a little seat. That main hole would be 14 feet. This smaller hole is going to be about 11 feet. Same as that 11 feet. Birds are going nuts. This is so cool. They're just chilling here watching the boat. They love it. This is the newest hole I'm working on. This is the flatter side. And this is the more curved side. And this is the bigger hole. It's symmetrical. That one's already done. We'll see what happens. Two sides together. And then after that, I go ahead and plane down the bottom, making sure it's smooth. And then I belt sand that. And then next up, I put some reinforcing rails on the sides. So I built this today. This is what I'll be using to bend and laminate some pieces of wood. that same arch will give me my deck curve on. This is the lamination process. Not too complicated. Just take a bunch of glue and smudge it around and get it centered. I use the piece of tape in the middle to keep everything centered and then make sure they're consistent with the clamps.
I remember surfing this wave as a kid. On a small day, it has a fast little section there. This spot over there catches a, a wedge wave. Two waves collide and it hits this real shallow reef right there. This is pretty deep. That's a pretty easy paddle out. I spent a lot of time surfing here. And here's a photo of me surfing that wave that left there.